You're watching 8 News at 530. I'm Heather Hope filling in for Eric Phillips tonight. I'm Deanna Albritton. Thousands of people with developmental disabilities in need of state support are stuck on a wait list here in Virginia. Capitol Bureau reporter Jackie DeFusco has more on what Governor Glenn Youngkin has plans to do about it. Jackie. Hey guys, well, Governor Youngkin says he wants to clear one third of the most urgent backlog this budget cycle and completely eliminate the line by the end of his term. Haley Smith has uncontrollable seizures, sometimes multiple times a day. Caring for the 22 year old is a full time job for her mom, Lisa. We don't want to put her in an institution. We want to keep her with us. But in order to do that, you know, there needs to be some funding for the family. And that's what we're getting now is the ability to take care of her. In the spring, Smith says they finally qualified for a Medicaid developmental disability waiver. So we waited over 14 years and at least three or four years at priority one status. Moving forward, she says it means the state will pay for 16 hours of in-home care each day, relieving stress, financial strain, and uncertainty. But many families are still shouldering that burden while they wait for support. They suffer in silence and it does take a toll. It takes a toll financially. It takes a toll emotionally. Governor Glenn Youngkin says more than 3,000 people are currently on Virginia's high priority wait list for waivers. Now, Youngkin wants to fund an additional 500 slots on top of the 600 that were already approved earlier this year. With the goal, and I hit my goals, of totally eliminating the priority one waiting list by the end of my term. State Senator George Barker expects Democrats will agree to Youngkin's goal or go further. I think it's certainly a realistic goal. It's certainly one that's well needed. But he says a shortage of caretakers could slow progress, even after lawmakers increased pay earlier this year. It is very hard to find someone who is willing to work at that wage. 